if you want, right, um, it's Minish Painter. Hope we're all doing very, very well. This is a project update, and the project in question is my English Civil War, all thanks to Dom and the others, um, and Martin Brook. Yeah, it's an update of, as you know, I finished the cavalry, um, the firelocks are done as well as you've seen. I've finished the pikemen, they're all sitting behind, just there, and I've also finished the Marquis of Newcastle's regiment of foot, so there are three, so yeah, ten of them. So I'm painting them up as them. So I'll turn the camera around and I'll just show you what I've been doing. See you in a minute. Right, folks. Here we have my project update. That's better. Let me just move this out of the way. That's better. Right. Um, first off, I'll show the pike. And I am really, really... Chuff with let's try and get a bit of light on the subject. With how these have turned out, especially the um, uniforms on oh, mold line there, it's horrible. Uh, yeah, really, really pleased with the way these have turned out. Facial details, uh, yeah, really, really chuffed, especially the uniforms and everything. I've gone for just the generic, because they're royalists, red, red coats or parts and red uniforms and sashes and stuff. Really, really pleased with these. Um, I've added this guy here, he's um, sort of like the officer in charge in a slightly different uniform. Really, really pleased with the way these have come out. So these at the bottom here I'll show you as well. These are my Marquis of Newcastle. Really, really happy with the way these have come out. I'm, I am really enjoying um, this current project. I will be returning to my Napoleonics with a Russian regiment deal which I'm going to be purchasing off Perry's website in a little while. It's 120 figures with an officer for about 50 quid. So yeah, really really pleased with the way these have come out, especially um, the highlights and the washes and everything. So like I said, I haven't based them because I'm going to wait until I get all of them painted the entire lot which I've got another one two three more regiments to do yeah really I'm so so pleased with the way these have come out but yeah um that is my project update um yes also just while I remember this is my one of my Wurtem Wurtemberg Wurtemberg Really pleased with the way that's what I've been working on as well. So, yeah, that is my whoops, stand this up. That is my project update. I've got another stand up, thank you. I'm going to be spraying in a little while, in the next five minutes, another batch. Not sure what they're going to be painted up as, unsure. And I've also got the Another one regiment, sorry, and then I've got eight command, which is like the flag bearers. Um, excuse me. I may paint up the another two regiments as the Marquis of Newcastle's regiment as well, with the command as well, just so I can do the whole lot. But this is an experiment for me, considering I've been painting Napoleonics for... about three and a half three and a half ish years I've been doing Napoleonic so this is a bit of a change for me 
always playing it something slightly different as well, like World War Two and larger figures, smaller stuff. But yeah, really, really have enjoyed this project so far. Um, yes, so thank you very much to Martin, Seventh Son, Dom, Steve, and all the others. So yeah, um, I'm waffling on now. It's been four and a half minutes, five minutes. Thank you very much for watching. I've been the Menace Painter. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, please. And I shall see you in the next one. Bye.